Alexander's Surname, Meaning, and History, presented by COADB.com. Surname Meaning? It is a Scottish, English, German, and Dutch surname from the personal name Alexander, derived from the classical Greek name Alexandros, from the Greek word Alexin, meaning to repel, and Andros, meaning man. Hence the name literally translates as repulsor of men, or more likely repulsor of the enemy, and its popularity during the Middle Ages was primarily due to the Macedonian conqueror, Alexander the Great, who lived from 35, 356 to 323 BC. Early bearers included Geoffrey Alexandra from Oxfordshire in 1273, Custance, or yes, I guess Custance Alexander from Cambridge in 1273, Henry Alexander from Yorkshire in 1379, and William Alexander from Edinburgh, Scotland in 1435. Knighthoods included Sir Robert Alexander of Hertfordshire in 1603, Sir Walter Alexander knighted in 1630, Sir Jerome Alexander of Dublin, Ireland, a judge, knighted in 1660, James Alexander, Sheriff of London in 1803, William Alexander, Baron of the Exchequer in 1824, Sir James Edward, Alexander, a captain in 1838, and Sir James Alexander, a lieutenant colonel in 1871. Noble titles held included the Alexander Baronetcy of Menstry in the county of Clackmannan in the Baronetage of Nova Scotia. It was created in 1625 for Sir William Alexander, a Scottish poet, and he was later elevated to Viscount Sterling in 1630 and Earl of Dovin in 1639. Here we see a list of the Earls of Sterling along with a portrait of Henry Alexander, the fourth Earl who died in 1691. The Alexander Baronetcy of the City of Dublin was a title in the Baronetage of the United Kingdom created for Sir William Alexander, the Lord Mayor of Dublin, the second Baronet. Sir Robert Alexander was director of the Bank of Ireland, and the third baronet, shown here, Sir John William Alexander, was attorney general to Albert Edward, Prince of Wales, who was later King Edward VII. They also held the Alexander Baronetcy of Mile in the parish of Mouchline in the county of Eyre. It was a title in the Baronetage of the United Kingdom, created in 1886 for major General Sir Claude Alexander, who served in the Crimean War and represented Ayrshire South in Parliament. And here we see the family estate of Bolich Mile. James Alexander was an Irish landlord and merchant and politician who was elevated to the peerage of Ireland as Baron Calden in 1790, Viscount. Calden in 1797 and Earl in 1800. And here we see Calden House, as well as another estate the family owned, Boom Hall in Londonderry. Landed gentry included Alexander of Boydstone in Ayr, Scotland. And. Here we see Carlung House in West Bride, Ayrshire, another property the family owned. Alexander of Westerton in Stirling in Scotland. Family estate was Powis House. Alexander of A. Hilly in Dungal, Ireland, and of Frowick House in County Essex, England. Alexander of Milford House in Carlow. And Alexander of Holwood in Kent. And lastly, Alexander of Forkhill in Armagh, Ireland. Notables included William Alexander, a Scottish journalist and author, born in 1826. Archibald Alexander, born in 1812, an army surgeon and deputy inspector general of the hospitals for Scotland. Archibald Alexander, born 1772, an American Presbyterian theologian and professor at the Princeton Theological Seminary. James Alexander, a Scottish-born lawyer and politician in colonial New York. Edward Porter Alexander, an American military engineer, railroad executive, planter, and author who served as an officer in the United States Army and later 
during the American Civil War and the Confederate Army rising to the rank of Brigadier General. Early settlers included Patrick Alexander, who came to Virginia in 1638, John Alexander, who came to Massachusetts in 1640, another John, who came to Carolina in 1700, James Alexander, Maryland in 16, I'm sorry, in 1714, and Peter and John Alexander came to Nova Scotia, Canada in 1749. And if you enjoyed this video, please visit us at coadb.com, where we offer genealogy research. Link in the description. Thank you very much.